but it's our local one. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, Jesus. How are you? Oh, well, very, very good. I should say excellent. That's good? Yeah. And today, I have our Mayor be of service. Well, um, first thing, I just, Nick has just explained. Uh, that I need to get the ego completely out of the way when I'm doing dowsing yes. uh, um, to get correct answers consistently so because you have to be calm when you're dowsing yes you have to be in, in a neutral space within yourself yes yep. so when you, be, when you come from a neutral yeah. Space. Then you allow the then you allow the universe to come through clearly. Yes. Yes. And when the universe comes through clearly, then 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 there will be no doubt in the answer. If you don't, if you don't let the ego get out of the way, then it can throw questions. In the way of your, in the way of the energy. Yes. Does that make sense? Yes, it does. Is it the ego that is creating these um, readings of extraterrestrial attachments, entities, or earthbound spirits, or is that, or are that, or, or are they, some of those are at least real? It is the ego. It is the ego. Some, some are real, some are the ego. Right. Does that make sense? Yes, I'm just, I'm seeking to. Because I'm writing and and intend to teach yes. dowsing, I want to be the best teacher possible, and I want to be the the most accurate possible, and I want to be in the most integrity in what I'm doing. Then, uh, then remember to come into the space within yourself and let the universe fill your body up. Yes, and let, allow yourself to. Feel the energy. You must remember, this is a sl slow process. Of becoming an expert dowser? Yes. Yes. This is a slow process of letting the universe fill you up and to know that you filled up with the universe so your dowsing cannot be interrupted. Yes. Does that make sense? Yes. I'm just uh, asking for any help that I can to expedite the, the process, <laughs> you know, to speed it up. But Expediting the process would not be any good. Right. I have, I have to go to a lawyer. Slowly. Right. Okay. Slow, slow is... Slowly is the best process. Right. Because then we can shed all your doubt and all your fear. And all your hesitation. Yes. That's why I say to you, meditate on the hill. Yes. Because when you're meditating on the hill, you go, you're high enough so the universe can go, come in and flow through you. And then that's where the energy pulls on the point of the hill. Hills. Right, so rather there than sitting on the bed or anywhere. Yes. Right, okay. Well, that's very clear. That's good. Does that make sense? Yes, it helps. It's very helpful. What are you doing up there? It just... Are you up on your bed? It takes quite a while. Oh. Okay. Yeah, Ros like you and may I say, don't be concerned how long it takes. Right. Yes. Because if you're following the path and following what I'm saying, Saying to you correctly, then it will be, then it will be sped up exponentially. Right. Okay. Good. Does that make sense? Yes, it does make sense. Yep. Yep. And I can, I can do as you say. Yeah. I will do as you say. Yeah. Yep. No, it's just you know. Um, I, I, I wish to be an in integrity 
all the time, and I wish to be accurate all the time, um, particularly when I'm charging other people for my services, and and um, and um, it, it it worries. It well, it's been of been of worry because it's of, of the nature of the work that um, you understand. Yes. But the thing is, you will feel if you're in the integrity or not. Yes. Yeah. Right? Yes. And some days you will go, I'm not doing, I'm not doing that with anybody because you will not do them. I'm not feeling pr totally full. present. I'm not feeling full, fully present. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Only, only do it if you're feeling fully present and confident yes. in your own abilities. Yeah. The way you get confident is by practicing your meditation and practicing your craft. Right. Right. And so they does that uh, make sense? Yes, it does. Got yes. Him and what what people do in the spiritual yeah, arena, um, Ross, yeah, the, is they just like the the rush um, yeah, somewhat, and if they allow the their gifts to bloom slowly, right. then they would a lot of. A lot more of you would be working in integrity. Right. Does that make sense? Yes, it does. Yeah, I'm using I'm using the metaphor of a flower growing from a bud. Yes. Um, and if I interfere with it or try and hasten it opening out, we 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 get nothing like we might otherwise. It is like it is like a old growth first. Yes. You're gonna plant. You've got to plant the sapling and then you've got to wait for the rain, rainfall. Yes, yes. To go down in the, go down in the soil and then the roots have got to go deep and find the river yes. underneath the ground. Yes. And they've got to have clear water. Yes. So you've got to have clear energy. So think of yourself as a and old growth forest. Right, okay. You've got to bury your roots yes. deep into the ground. Yes. Right? Yes. And then you've got to draw the air energy up through the tree that you are. Yes. And so your body has to be has to become the divining that they haven't seen. Divining rod. Divining rod, yes. Yep. You've got to flow with it. You've got to, you've got to be, become the human pendulum. Yes. Does that make sense? Yes, it does. Yep. And then, once you know that you are the human pendulum with out of doubt, you will be completely relaxed. Does that make sense? Yes. Yep. And then you will know through your relaxed state that you're working in absolute integrity. Because right. you will know it within your own heart. Yes. Yep. It takes... It takes years, but if you're following your path, uh, yes. Properly in clearly, it, it won't yeah. seem like you. Right. Does that make sense? Yes, I understand that. Yeah. Yeah. And this is why it, this is why the universe does things slowly. Right. Because we don't want to rush. Right. What what makes what makes a human rush is the egalic mind. Because you think that you're on time streams here. Yep. That you've got to do things by a certain age. Yes. Yes. But if you if you let if you remember to flow with the universe inside of you, your life will be extended. The work that you do will be extended. Agreeing yes. with what the dogs want. And what do they That's want? not happening. Oh, they don't want to be No, because last life, Bukwu never had their um, 
Does that make sense? Yes, it does. Very much so. so you She's happy to be pregnant again? Yep. So you must just yeah, but she wants to keep it. Yeah. go with the flow. Oh, you know, because probably they've always been right. taken away. Hey, maybe too early. Yeah, a lot of my days, I, these, I, I'm going with the flow, and Giselle is going with the flow a lot more um, since we've met you in this in this form. Um, and I feel that we are both making a lot of progress. That's, that, that's, that's, that's my, my feeling from... I got feeling. So um, I guess that is enough just to keep going and doing what we're doing and be patient with ourselves and be understanding. But, yeah. That's all you, all you can do. Yes. Is be patient with yourself and listen to the universe. Yes. Yes. Yeah. That, that is all. And then you need to be patient and listen. And listen to yourself. Right. right. And listen to all the self. Does that make sense? Yes. Yep. If you want, if you want, if you want things to be expedited, you just need to be relaxed. Right. And let, let us come through. Yeah. Clearly, it's, um, yeah. and the way we, the way we we'll come through you is by what you're, what you're getting through your pendulum, pendulum. And we, I speak to you in meditation. You've heard me speak to you. You've, you've felt me speak to you. Have you not? Thank you, pardon. You felt you. Yes. Heard me speak to you. Yes. You felt me speak to you in your meditation. Yeah, um, not in words, but in like, feelings sometimes. Yeah. Yes. Stuff yes. Yeah. I'm not, I, haven't, I haven't been hearing you in words in to the extent that I've been no, aware but, of my meditation. No, but you've been, you've been, you've been, you've been feeling my feelings yes. flowing yes. through you. Yes, yes. I haven't been coming in words, not yet, because you... Your yeah, mind will get in the think. way. Right. Well, when you, um, it takes when you allow, they use, they use the same when you allow your stuff, feelings but it might take to be clear, then I can come through clearly. Right. And maybe does that make sense? Yes, or well, I'm, so I'm learning. And it does. Yes. Have you heard um, my? I, you must have heard. You oh, that's a stupid question, but anyway, have you heard me express my needs? Uh, two or but three needs in the last yes. in the last few, few meditations. I have. Thank you. Yeah. And they're and most people want you to they're being do. addressed. Thank you. Like if you don't need products, you've got to listen. Crop, um, when needs. when fruit trees. Yeah. When you express a need or a want, say yes. just had clear you've got to listen tree. back. To your feelings, because we answer you straight away, and we will guide you to where you need to be. Yes. Does that make sense? Yes. Are those uh, needs and and and, and uh, what's uh, reasonable or appropriate? Is there? They are reasonable. Yes. Oh, yeah, you've got to give money. But they are being, money. being addressed very, very slowly. Right. So you will get the answer that for, you will get the answers that well, you, can use it for that you are looking for. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Jesus, before you do go, um, I woke up this morning after a, um, a pretty shitty dream fragment to use colloquial English. Uh, yes. Right, and um, just in general, when we have dreams like that, are we clearing past events, or what are we doing? Uh, is You're that what's the sim? Clearing past memories. Hmm. You're clearing past memories. Right. Fine. Okay. Excellent. That's what you are doing. You were clearing past memories, so you may move forward in your experience. Excellent, right. 
Does that mean we forget those memories when we say clearing past memories or no, we're putting them in a different context? You do not forget them. Right. They just simply make more sense. Right, okay. To you. Yes. Because you're finally detached from the negative aspect of it. Yep. Does that make sense? Yes, it does. Yep. So, so we're, we're reframing them, we're recontexting them. Well, is that. You are reframing your outlook on them. Yes. Outlook on the memory of them. Yes. You were seeing what you could not see before. Yes. Does that make sense? Yes, it does. Thank you. A lot of humanity jumps to conclusions when they have experiences and they don't let them play out properly. They always have opinions about realities before they come, come to pass. That's where you eat. As a race, that's where you eat garlic more. The egalic mind gets you into a little trouble. You don't, you, you sort of, the way you should have an experience, experience is have a thought, let that thought come into your reality, experience it, then, then to, then to society, to this, excuse me, I've just got a gym. Then, society feeling to it. Right. Does that make sense? Yep. Yeah, I'll then not just that. Then continue on. Don't, society, don't, 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 don't say, oh, I'm going, I'm going to have this, this experience, then, then, sign that, then, then say, oh, I'm going to have this outcome. Because the outcome might be completely different. Yes. So you've just got to experience it for what it is. And so then say, so right, well, I'm gonna now I'm gonna have have a feeling on it. Don't do it before. No. Does that make sense? Yes it does. I'm thinking in particular of over the last few years of recurrent tsunami wave like dream segments that I didn't feel in, wrapped up in the tsunami um, or there wasn't, I didn't get caught in the wave or anything, but I saw the vision, I've seen the vision many times of, yes. of um, huge waves approaching and just starting to fall like a dumper, but then the dream moves on. And, um, and um, Because, because you're intuitive. And you can feel everyone's emotions. So that's why you get the visions of tsunamis. Does that make sense? Not completely. Well, you can see the universe is showing you glimpses of futures. Yes. So you can experience what the other people are actually experiencing, why they're having it. So you know not to call that into your physical self. Yes, so... Does that make sense? Yes, to, so, so if I am understanding what you're saying, then some people in the world are calling in that, uh, those sorts of events into their... to, to um, terminate their life um, in a physical form. Well, the reason they do it is because they've remembered all they can in their body and they've agreed to go they've agreed to go out in that way yes. does that make sense yes it does yes it's not a negative thing it is just how it is yeah yeah all right i must go okay thank you thank you you're welcome i'm sorry my boy i'm sorry that Nicole voice was a little bit catchy but some sometimes when he's been working all day, working all day and gets to the end of the day his body struggles with with the channel. Yes. Yeah. It doesn't mean that I'm not in the body, it means that 
We just have to readjust the treating folks, yeah. so yeah. to speak. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Okay, thank you, thank you and blessings, love thank and gratitude. You. Blessings, love and gratitude. Hello, everybody. Hi, Nick. Greetings. Okay, and thank you. Thank you, Nick. Thank you very, very much. My friend. Right here. All right. <laughs> Look at this. Look at this. Okay. Bliss for three. Yes. Um, and all and bliss for maybe for um for twelve. <laughs> no she, No, she is pregnant but sorry, I'll just do my Not own. nine.